I think the proper role for any school board is to teach kids. Uh, parents uh, look after their own children. There should be parental responsibility instilled in not only Ontarians but all Canadians. That's important if you're going to have a child. Uh, I think that uh, in this particular case, it appears that a, a little girl went to school with a drawing. It could have been of anything, um, and it, it, you know, ch child protection is paramount. Uh, that said, uh, I'm not sure in this case a strip search was warranted. Uh, it seems to be. Uh, it, well, it was rather invasive, and it has many parents across Ontario uh, and across Canada wondering if, if this is the next step of, of Dalton McGuinty's Ontario. You know, I can't speak um, to the specific case because it's not appropriate for any of us in, uh, to comment on cases that are, you know, under current investigation by children's aid societies or by the police. But I can tell you that the Child and Family Services Act, which sets out our collective obligations to look after children in Ontario is very clear that in fact all of us have a duty to report when we have reasonable grounds to believe that a child might be in harm's way and we set in that act a really specific and higher level of standard an obligation for teachers uh, because teachers are with children every day uh, and so the act sets out those parameters um, and it, it, it is uh, required uh, that if a teacher has reasonable grounds to believe that a child might be in harm's way that they have an obligation to report that information on to children's aid societies who then take it uh, and it is then within their area of responsibility.